I've shared with two or three people, maybe four, uh, what this is. This has been in the works for a little while. And it's finally arrived today. This is the world's first, one and only, most exclusive pump you've ever seen. It's the only one in existence. I want to mar it up. I want to be careful. You're dying to see what's in there, aren't you? I can tell you that you've never seen anything like it before. This is the one and only Sweet 16. And this is the only one in existence. This is the 16 gallon per minute super pump from Cody Yarbrough. This is his personal pump that he sent me. This is a prototype that you've seen on the videos. You've seen at the trade show. You've seen it in his shop. He put this together for me, made me a custom little skid, and we're gonna crack it open. They're all unwrapped. And Cody has put this together for me with the Smart Blend Pro, which is remote control proportioning so that we can push the button on the remote and choose what percentage we want. We got one dial on SH, and SH is here, water's here, and a dial on soap. We got the beautiful clear manifold, and all of this is one inch plumbing. These are the Skunk Works valves that he makes. Remote control to turn things up and down. Gonna be crazy slick. There's a bypass over here, so we can draw just water and not go through the proportioner. And then of course, We've got the baddest ass pump on the planet, the Super Pump 16. These are like eight gallon heads on each side that dual port into this reel with a one inch manifold throughout. Three quarter inch hose, okay, on a red gun, about 200 feet of it, on the real big deal. I gotta put the handle on it, which is inside the box. And then Cody has this beautiful, stainless steel box with barn doors look at that very cool and this bad boy runs on a 24 volt battery that's what this is this is a lithium battery made by epic batteries it's a beast bolted right into the box all your proportioning suction hoses back here <clears throat> this thing has a speed dial on it. There's going to be a special knob that goes on here. Okay, remember, this is a prototype. There's a special knob that's being made that's going to go on here. We're going to be able to turn this pump, zzz, zzz, run it real low, crank it right up. Power switch here to run the pump. Power switch here to run the proportioner. Real nice connections. Okay, I'm going to spin this thing around. It's starting to rain out here a little bit. That's okay, it's made to get wet. And we're gonna put a little water through this and see what it can do. So Cody gave me this thing so that I can be the test pilot and show you guys real world what this thing's gonna do. I'm gonna put it through its paces and we're gonna showcase what can be done with some 24 volt power. It's been a few minutes, I've had a few things to do. I had to have some dinner, it's been a long day. But I'll show you guys, we got the big 24 volt battery in here, all powered on. If you can see the little blue light on it. See it right there? Got it powered on. We got a 50 amp breaker in the back there. This is uh, some of the electronics for the remote controls, apparently. Don't, I don't understand that yet. We will have to put a small 12 volt battery in here. I think I'm gonna put one of my big marine batteries in here, actually, because I'm gonna be wanting to run everything off of one battery. Uh, for as far as like reels and flow pro and whatnot go but these will hook up onto the nice 12 volt right there we'll have a little bit of storage still over here we got the big reel deal with a one inch manifold three quarter inch hose i don't know cody put a couple hundred feet on there it's stacked he gave me a really nice red gun with a swivel on it ready to go i'm gonna turn this back onto the trigger lock on because i just primed it all up but she's ready to go you turn the 
pump on back here, switch here, boom. And then there's a speed dial right here. I got it turned all the way off right now. I'm gonna turn it up a little bit. Hear the pump come on. And that's on the lowest setting. That's a good 25, 30 feet or more away from me. Probably Remco power right there. I wish I had a third hand. I'm gonna turn this up a little bit more. That's maybe about third power. And I'm gonna say that's probably about X6 power and distance there. That's barely turned up at all. Let's turn it up a little bit more. I think that's maybe three quarters. Still real good distance. Plenty of power. Let's just go wide open. Listen to this. What? Nice distance. Peak of my house, over the peak of my house, from the driveway with no problem. Got some wind going on right now. A little sizzle. Oh yeah. Lots of slap. Lots of power. And it stops immediately. Look how sick that thing is. Ready? Big power, and it's off. I'd like to squirt the dog, but that wouldn't be very nice, would it? Uh, uh, oh, don't do it. Okay, I can't do it. It's not very nice. To shoot the house, though. Plenty of distance on the house. Quite the pump. Very impressed. World exclusive right here, gentlemen. So now, we're gonna be a day or two, unfortunately, before we can get this on the truck. Because I have to wash tomorrow. Then I gotta make room for it and plumb everything. But we're gonna get this thing in use as quickly as possible and show you what it's all about. See what kind of volume it actually drinks. We're gonna be flow testing it. All that good stuff. This is a 35 gallon, that's a 50 gallon. That's a 50 gallon soap tank. And I've gone through almost half of it just in this few minutes of video. So I know she's drinking a lot. Catch you later.